Welcome guys back to another video, and today here we're gonna get his hands on the haircut. Are you ready? Oh, Alright. Right now we'll be back, okay? Yeah, 
I need one. We talked about so far yeah. in 78 here, and you can see those uh, mid to upper 70s just about yeah, everywhere. You, 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 you got to do it. Uh, huh? 10 to 80 you got to do it. You got to do it. So here's the deal. We've got an area of high pressure in the tower of the Atlantic. It's been kind of sitting there. There's a big bubble of air bringing us that southerly wind blow. We need a lot of warmth, but it's keeping all that rain well out to our west. That's where it's going to hang out. What's the YouTube channel about? Oh, we do like challenges for the best well, Saturday night on into Sunday morning. So let me take you hour by hour through tonight and show you that the 70s are going to be very, very slow to cool. We're going to get back down to the 60s or so by the 11 o'clock hour and then through the overnight. A lot of clouds out there, very little in the way of any precipitation to begin your Saturday. Wake up temperatures in the 60s, and then by the time we get to Saturday afternoon, we're going to be right back into those mid and upper 70s, if not yeah, well, we get on down on the south side. Yeah. We'll take a look at your rain chances for Saturday night and Sunday. Yeah. Also, give you a little peek inside the yeah. yeah. International Auto yeah. Show. We'll do that for you. It's um, about 10 minutes. I do it sometimes. Take a good time out there. Yeah. Time out for a look at Sky Fox traffic in the evening rush hour outside. As we take a look at a live picture through our Georgia uh, Department of Transportation tower camera. This is I-75 on the south side. Boy, a slow crawl in that southbound in Henry County tonight. This is uh, near 675. Another no, 45 minutes to get from 285 to Hampton McDonough Road. Downtown Connector, meantime, another slow spot in either direction. About 20 minutes going north and southbound between Brookwood and uh, Mikeford Park. I'll look at it once. Meantime, the east wall of 285 from Spaghetti Junction to I-20. That ride taking you over 30 minutes tonight. And the west wall of 285 from the Cobb Road Relief to I-20 taking you just over 30 minutes tonight. Well, Tom, this may be the shortest police chase ever. Minus pursuit took only seconds ahead. Donald Trump picks up another big endorsement. How it could fix one of the controversies that's swirling around his campaign next. It's Mattress Firm's semi-annual sale. A sale so big it happens just twice a year. Twin mattresses start as low as $59.99. Queen mattress sets for only $199.99. Plus get 0% APR for four years. Only at Mattress Firm.
controversy that surrounded his campaign. When you think about the idea of, for example, some of these rallies, some of the troubles, the racial questions, the KKK and all that, I think, again, it has power there. I think this really does help Donald Trump. Meanwhile, Florida Senator Marco Rubio is in the fight of his political life. Recent polls showed Trump leading Rubio in the Sunshine State amid calls for the senator to drop out. We are understanding here that what we are electing is not simply hey, someone who's supposed to entertain. I wanted a gorgeous family room, like you see in the magazines. Bassett helped me with a complete makeover. Save 30% on custom furniture, plus 25% store-wide. I got the room I always imagined. In 1934, Steak and Shake decided the world didn't need another hamburger. It needed a steak burger. So they used 100% beef. Quick sear to seal in the flavor you'll only get from a steak burger. Steak and Shake, home of the original steak burger. Get out. And 
Rambo, who was trapped in a stall. They tried to open the door. Um, Jose, my family member, and Hoey, he tried to get the door open and burned his hand. You feel fresh? Huh? You feel fresh? This family manages to still look to the future. I don't know what I'm going to be doing 10 minutes from now. But your I turn know come that soon and very soon we'll be back to where we're supposed to be. And we started from nothing, so we don't know anything else but to build, and that's what we're going to do. 19 horses survived the fire. A GoFundMe page is set up for pure horse play. And Bill Rick and Christina Chase, News Radio 1067, Ford Fox 5 News. Well, the hunt is on for this inmate who escaped from the Banks County Jail this morning. Canine search got news for the sheriff's office. They were looking for 23-year-old Paul Villa Rose. This is being held in burglary and theft by receiving and obstruction charges. He was somehow able to escape from the recreation area of the Banks County Jail. Paul Villa Rose is 5'9", 150 pounds, with brown hair and hazel eyes. If you have information about his whereabouts, here is the picture. <laughs> hey guys, welcome guys back. Um, he just got his hair cut, dude. There's like a little bald spot. Where? Oh, right, that's yeah, my there. birthmark. Oh, that's your birthmark? Yeah. I didn't know that. Uh, well, yeah, we're going. We're um, yeah, we're going back home. Or you want to walk? Yeah. Let's uh, go. Oh shoot! Sure. <laughs> yes, yeah, my hair. Your hair just fell off. I. Hey, so, yeah. yeah, we'll pause it, guys. We'll pause it real quick. Alright, so, guys, yeah, we're walking home, and Anton got his hair cut. So, let me gotta get to the other side. No, no, no. We gotta go to the other side. Not yet, though. Still gotta wait. Well, I was hoping we could go to the store. I mean, we still have, I don't know. Check your phone. How much time do we have? They're leaving at 6.30. How long does it it's take? It's 5.40. Let's call her. Who's cross? Okay. Yeah, should we call her right now so she can pick it up? Pick this up? Yeah. yeah. Wait, what time is it though? What store do we go to? I just waited. Okay. Okay, ready, bro. I'm not going too far. Or should we go somewhere else? I don't know. Oh, no, we gotta be somewhere close because... Yeah. Yeah, so Rite Aid, oh no, she, wait, she can leave us with Rite Aid and then, wait, which way does she go to cheerleading? Hello? We're done. Win! <laughs> we're, um, we're at Chandler's house, like right past his house. And I was just, we were wondering if he could take us to the store. situation I, I just heard a whole bunch of yeah boo, 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 cussing yeah. and then we're just yelling at each other someone got kicked out of the house that's, exactly that's, someone got that's fun someone got kicked out of the house i'm gonna try to zoom in okay i'm gonna see if i can zoom in wait someone got kicked out of the house Oh, they cut down most of our forest. Yeah, she. They cut down most of our like not forest, but like, like woods. yeah, woods. The mayor bought it. Huh? Ooh, the mayor bought our land. For real? Yeah. How do you know? Because I know. How do you know? Because um, someone that went on mom's friends went to the um county meeting or the city meeting, and the mayor bought it. It's the mayor to do it. Why would you buy that? Exactly. What is the what is the idea? Dude, we're gonna be here. We're bar we're barely gonna be able to breathe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Damn, my hair. No wonder I've been feeling dizzy. <laughs> Dude, what if I drop my phone in there? In that lake. That'd be fun. <laughs> what? <laughs> what if it was still recording?